Hey everybody, and welcome to my usual me, and welcome to a brand new map called Art Genesis. Okay guys, well this map is uh, created by People's Gaming as well as Twitch RP. They're in conjunction with each other, and it's been in development for about 17, 18 weeks now. And it's been on the Steam Workshop for mm, a bit, probably about a little bit more than a week. Um, it has a lot of the aberration creatures and a lot of the scorch earth creatures. I don't want to say all of them because somebody's going to come in and say, oh, well, it didn't have this. But uh, I but I found that we, we have almost all of the creatures from both of those DLCs. So uh, if you don't want any of the DLCs, guys, and you want to have everything in one tight little package, this map is a way to go. map looks like this. And it is, let me see if we get the best view. There we go. And it, we're right there at uh, about 30 or about 55, 30 or so. And we're right here on the edge of this lake. And it is amazing. Now, you're probably going to want to know where to spawn in right off the bat. So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to put down my feather light because light creatures are a thing. That's, we don't even use lights. We use our, we use our light pets to, to light this house. So we're going to go ahead and we're just, we've been playing this all weekend long. It's really super good. I'm going to go ahead and we're going to get rid of all of my element and get rid of my tech rifle and let me go ahead and take off my, all my armor right quick i'm going to go ahead and spawn in the easy spawn where we started this weekend so you have an idea of where to go to when you're spawning in i'm going to take a couple bites here because my guy can't be hungry and there we go all right we're going to go ahead and spawn over i'm going to get myself killed and we'll be right back Alrighty guys, well West Zone 1 is where we spawn where we spawned in originally. Now if you want to go into South Zone 1, that's okay too. They're not that far apart, and either one is is easy enough to survive, so I would suggest either West Zone 1 or South Zone 1. We'll go into South Zone 1. I'll get myself killed, and then we'll see how it is. Look, okay, so we've got a bunch of herbivore spawns right here. It shouldn't be that bit difficult. There are some raptors around here. There's quite a few raptors on the map, so you got to be careful. Uh, but there is pteranodons. I know there's a T-Rex or two around here, so be careful. A lot of people are complaining about they put their bases in the easy areas and they're getting wrecked after three or four hours. There's a T-Rex right there. I mean, it is art, guys. Be ex be expect you're going to have some carnivores. Let me go ahead and get this guy to eat my face right quick. Eat me, boy. Come on. Eat me. Oh, did I poop myself? I didn't even poop myself. Dude, why did I not poop myself? Kill me! Come on, chump! Chomp me, chump! Let's go! That's more like it. West Zone 1 is where I actually spawned originally, so we're going to go ahead and go there. Now, this does have raptors. Now, that's just up the just up the street from where we, where we just were, but it, we're right here on the edge of the lake. Now, our base is up and around the corner there, so... What I did was I started right here, and there is a Sarko right there, a Sarko spawn. So be careful when you're in the water, because he is going to want to eat your face. But that's a really kind of semi-easy tame uh, for when you're level 35. That is the saddle level, I believe. Sarko. I have one tamed at the house right now. It's level 35, the Sarko saddle. So if you hit level 35, you're gonna have an easy water tame right here that's really quick. So I would suggest highly, I would highly suggest taming one of these guys right now. They only take about, oh, I'd say about four or five trank darts, maybe uh, probably about double that with narco arrows. So, you know, if you have 20, 30 narco arrows, you'd probably be okay. We went ahead and we came over here though, right off the bat. And I'm talking about Monogard, my gaming partner and me. She's my current gaming partner uh, at the moment. Um, her and I came over here, and we built over here. And you have, of course, you have Pegos and you got Ichthyornises. So you got to be careful. Oh my, Mr. Dodo's in the water. No, Mr. Dodo. I'm not going to save you. This right here, guys, is a new feature. This is a tall grass. You cannot harvest this. Uh, you cannot do it, and you can't see through it. So if there's an, a raptor in the grass, you're going to probably get pounced on. So be careful with this tall grass, guys. This is a big, big deal. I the first thing I noticed when I got in here. But what we did was we threw some spike walls up. We put a little base here, and this is how we got our start. So I went ahead and I we tamed up because I, w I wanted to show on stream the new animals that, that after the TLC patch too. We got a skinny, skinny triceratops. <laughs> Let me take his skin off. 
you know, I got these skins, right? So, anyway, we got a brand new trike, and we got one of the Parasaurs. Now, these guys are a part of my, um, my, my crew now, so these guys should, Parasaur should be, let me put my hood back on. He should be showing me, what was that? What was that over there? I saw yellow. He should be showing me the, uh, the bad guys. Oh, they detected an enemy. Look at that. Which is going to be either a Ichthyornis or a Pegamastix, probably. And let's see if we can get up on a rock, see if we can see him detect some of this stuff. There it is. I think it's probably... Oh, it's the Ichthyornis that's right over there. And those guys are a pain in the butt. You know how it is. And he detected another enemy. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's the same one. All right, see, that detection by the Parasaur is all well and good. I spawned in a... Re I, I created a brand new character, and when I came by this base, it showed me the Parasaur had detected me. So, uh, the, if somebody is coming by your base, something to remember, the Parasaur will... They will know that the Parasaur has detected them. So, they might... It's a double-edged early warning system because the people know that you know that they are detected, so... All right, so that's uh, the West Spawn 1, the easy one. Let's go ahead and get ourselves killed on my spikes. Can I kill myself on my own spikes? I can't. So we're going to jump. Oh, let's go over and say Mr. hello to Mr. Sarko. Hello, Mr. Sarko. How are you today? Oh, my God, death roll. <laughs> Give me the death roll. I want to see it. Show it to the people. Do it. Show it to the people. Death roll me. Come on, buddy. Come on, death roll me. He's not, I'm not going to do it again. Come on, do it again. There it is. Oh, the death roll. I love it. <laughs> okay, guys. We're going to go ahead and we're going to go to... Let's see. Um, We did south. We did west. Let's go ahead and go to uh, east... Oh, east zone easy. I don't know about uh, east zone easy. Where are we exactly? Okay, so it spawned us about um, 18... 78, 1875, somewhere in there. Doesn't look like there's anything here. This might be a cool little cove. There's a raptor right there. That's not going to be good. All right, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to go this way. Ooh, there's some Meganuras. Nice little quiet beach to, to spawn on to build a base, man. Get a little start. So you know, all you have to do is watch out for one raptor. That's, that's pretty good. Let me jump in the water and see what's in the water. I do see sharks. Are those pearls down in there? There's pearls down in there, guys. So, oh my god, I don't want to die to a shark. Not just yet, not just yet, no! I want to die to the raptor, because I want to show you what the raptor's pounce looks like. Okay, this guy just spawned in. For those of you who don't know what these new special abilities in the TLC Patch 2 came, when it came out, what they look like, I kind of wanted to show you a couple things. Where'd that raptor go? I hear him. Here it comes. Here it comes. Where is he? There he is. Come after me. Pounce on me, dude. Pounce on me. Pounce on me. Do it. Do it. Pounce. There he is. There's the pounce. And you can't do anything for like four or five seconds. Oh my gosh. It's brutal. There you go. Now you can get up and run away. Can he catch me? I'm pretty fast, guys. I'm level 96 or something. Level 98, maybe. Uh, but... Kill me. Kill me. I have a lot of health. <laughs> okay, very cool, very cool. We've been on the, on this map for all weekend long, all weekend long. So, all right, the North Zone is the hardest zone of all of them. Uh, people were saying that the, the cold wasn't implemented yet, but I think that it is. Oh, this is not, this is not North. This is not North. But we're going to go North Zone 3, uh, no, North Zone 1, and see what that has to say for itself. That's the North. That's not north, that's mid, which is right near the city. All right, this is north zone one, and it's hard. Oh, shoot. Bugs right off the bat. That's bugs, so that's not that difficult. How hard is this? Why is it difficult? Why is it hard? I want to know. We are exactly at... Oh, we are in the north. It was wrong. It showed me... That, okay, so we are in the north, smack dab in the center of the map. We're at 2050, guys. 2050. So it doesn't look that difficult right now. But then again, the animals haven't spawned in yet because I don't think I've been here yet. Oh, that's a well, that's a Trudon. 
Okay, guys, remember that the uh, the devs are adding stuff to the map all the time. They're changing stuff. They're actually going to take out the volcano because he didn't like it. So he's actually going to move some stuff around, and it, things are going to be um, changed up quite a bit. So I want you to go ahead and be aware of that. So let's go ahead. I think we're going to hit another hard area. Come here. Kill me, Trudon. Kill me, Trudy. Kill me. Kill me. Yeah, there you go. Knock me out. Knock me out. Kill me. Oh, my God. Here we go. Here we go. It's a party now. Alrighty guys, well we are in North Zone 3 and this is right here next to the Black Pearl Lake right there that he's created. And there are black pearls here. That's the te that's the tech city right in front of me. This is one of two cities that will be created. The second one is what he's calling Gungan City. It's an underwater city, kind of like out of Star Wars, he said. So if you like Gungan City, you should be excited for that. But we're going to go do the city in a different episode. Right now, I'm going to go ahead and run down here and show you Black Pearl Lake and why I call it Black Pearl Lake. It's because there are black pearls in it. Okay, I haven't started to freeze just yet, but they, he's going to change that. So when you're in the north, you are going to freeze. You should be freezing any second now. There it is. When you're on the ice, you're going to start to freeze, guys. And it's brutal. Like, I've already started to take damage pretty hard. And my fortitude right now is 30. So it's... I, what level am I? I'm level 93. So, yeah, it's, it's pretty brutal. But if you go underneath the shelf here where the penguins are, you're going to see... Let me drop down. There's nothing that's, that'll hurt you down in this water yet. Yet. That might change. But there are black pearls down in here, guys. Black pearls right here. There you go. Get 70. Oh, well, I, we have our rates turned up. By the way, it, be careful when you're swimming because you see I'm walking down below. This right now does not have the swimming all the way down. I actually fell and damaged myself, and then the cold killed me. So, yeah, be, be careful, guys. Be careful. Black pearls are heavy, but we have the weight turned up here, so I'm actually able to carry 955 pounds at the moment. So, you know, I mean, 151 black pearls weigh 300 pounds. So be aware that those are actually super heavy. All right, guys. So see, you know, I'm running around at the bottom, and it's got no... Be careful when you come down in here. Swim on the edge until you start to walk. Like, I'll start to swim here in a minute. There you go, like that. See? So only about the, the top half is swimmable. After that, it's going to walk. He'll, he'll fix it eventually. Like I said, this out, this map is in, in beta, but just bear with it. It's got constant fixes coming in. About once every week or two weeks, he's going to put something in. He's going to change something. There will be specific bosses to this map. So just be aware that there's going to be some unique stuff. He's going to make the city super hard to get element and to get... Um, the congealed gas balls. He's got them in carts or crates right now, so that's going to be a thing. I'm going to go get and get killed by this raptor, guys, and we're going to we're going to head on back to the house. Go to sleep, little man. Go to sleep. All right, guys. Well, I've geared back up, got my my feather light on my shoulder, and got Pickle Rick to give me a ride over here, and we're going to go ahead and I'm going to show you exactly where this base is. This base is at 6412.3, so on the map. So that's where we're going to be. That's where it is, at the uh, southwestern edge of that lake. So that is just right there at west, easy west. So if you want to build your base down here, this is where you're going to be. And our actual other base is on the upper, the middle side of that lake, which is going to be about 3025 or so. That's or 5025 is about where it's going to be. 5025 is where our other base is. And we're going to go ahead and I'm going to show you all about that in the next episode, guys. So, hey, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do that right now. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. And we'll see you next time in Ark Survival Evolved. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye.